need computer training for a group or office, contact us today to get a free demo of our training at www.teachucomp.com forward slash enterprise dash licensing. You can use the buttons in the Alignment button group on the Layout tab of the Table Tools Contextual tab in the ribbon to change the alignment of selected cell content. To do this, select the cells whose text alignment you wish to change, and then click the desired alignment button in the Alignment button group. Note that the buttons shown control both the horizontal and vertical alignment of the content for the selected table cells. To change the direction that the text flows within a selection of cells, you can use the Text Direction button in the Alignment button group to rotate the direction of the text in the selected cells by 90 degrees each time you click the button. You can also change the amount of spacing placed between the edge of the cell and its text, or the amount of spacing placed between the cells themselves by adjusting the cell margins. Note that changing the setting affects all cells in the whole table. To do this, click into the table whose cell spacing you want to alter, and then click the Cells Margins button. This will open up the Table Options dialog box. In the default Cell Margins section, Use the spinner boxes to set the amount of spacing for each side, top, bottom, left, and right. To set an amount of spacing between table cells, check the Allow Spacing Between Cells checkbox and enter the amount of spacing by using the small spinner button to the right of the checkbox. Under the Options section, you can check the Automatically Resize to Fit Contents checkbox to apply the content auto-fit behavior to the cells. This replicates the auto-fit contents option as we saw when we used the auto-fit button in the same group. Once you have finished entering your settings, click the OK button. Like what you see? Get a free demo of our training for groups of five or more at www dot forward slash enterprise dash licensing.